Praise be Jesus Christ. My name is Brother Mikael. I belong to the Contemplative St. Joseph Monastic Order in South San Francisco. While discerning my role in this life as a child of God, I happened to serve at a Mass, and there I rediscovered the Holy Eucharist, which for me was the most profound and yet most mysterious um, thing that ever happened to me. The waters of everlasting life I felt like flowing out of my heart. And I said, Lord, what, what do you want from me? What, what's going on? And so some days later, this thought of priesthood, of mass, never uh, stopped appearing in my head and in my heart. So since then, I've constantly focused my thoughts, prayers on the mystery of the Holy Eucharist, which is happening at, the, at every Holy Mass. Without Holy Mass, without the sacrament of love, which is the Holy Eucharist, I couldn't see myself as being a true child of God, so to speak, because Christ is fully and substantially present there. And so if He, the author of life, who gave Himself for me, is present there, how can I not uh, <laughs> meditate and how can I not at least try to live out the Eucharist, which is not just happening here at the altar, but we are supposed to live it out there in the world. If we as Catholics don't realize this, then we will just come to Mass as being another event and not Mass radically change us. You know, we need to understand Mass as God's invitation to live with Him. I pray that all of us will come to this at least intellectual and then experiential understanding of what the Holy Eucharist is for us Catholics. Because when we receive Christ in it, we go out and serve Him in the poor and the needy. Without it, we are just social workers. We are not uh, evangelizing for the salvation of souls. So may God bless you all and may our Most Holy Lady protect you with her mantle. Amen.